Hello. This is our spare room. This is the one Lou and Bob was supposed to sleep in, but it's too far away from the bathroom. So we thought maybe this would be a better idea to give him another one. But this was Megan's old room. And I don't want to change the color of it because it's going to be horrible to get over the red. And then we come out of this room, it used to be the garage, into the den. Fireplace, shelves. That I got in Pennsylvania about 19 years ago when the wind lived there. Still going. It's a good wreath. And the den is connected into the kitchen. Is our little tiny TV. And I made the kitchen all sunflowers. And that goes into the backyard. There's a sliding glass door. And then the kitchen is connected to the dining room. That you've seen in other pictures before. With the photos on this side. And there's more pictures on this side. Kevin's got, Kevin's got pictures of the little shorties all over the wall. Another set of the shorty pictures. And this side is the living room. And Kevin's grandfather clock. When he retired, he got this clock. Well, I think this was maybe 45 years with the company, the clock. Let me go down the hallway where we have pictures of the kids, more pictures of the granddaughters, pictures of my kids when they were little. Pictures on this side of the hallway. And then around the corner we have more pictures on the wall. A poem by my son. And around here is the washroom, washer and dryer. And Kevin put in cabinets so I have room for all my garbage. The bathroom, my lavender bathroom, and this is all seashell and fish, lighthouses, what have you. The toilet, which lights up at night and the lids go down automatically with all the men are really happy about. And it's mostly all beach, beach things. You need my little beach chair, which I love. And all my seashells. And we go down into, this used to be one of the kids' rooms, but we converted it into a playroom for the girls. There's all their toys in here, their kitchen, shopping carts. All their toys are in the closet. And then Kevin's pictures are all over the walls.
Here's my dad and Ion. Different pictures of flowers. And this wall is mostly the kitties, which has a lot of... Let me try to get this closed so you can see. We have too much light in here. It's all the kids. St. Patrick Cathedral. He has the girls basically all over the wall. He's got pictures um, of sunsets, the beach, the aquarium. This one is a really big one. You can't see it because of the light, but it's uh, it's a bridge. And then we have Kevin's cameras, all his antique cameras. The cabinet, which I still think the girls are going to go through the glass one of these days. And then across, diagonally across from them, is my bedroom, which we're changing over in color. It went from blue and brown, it's now going to yellow and gray. Big screen TV that the company gave him when he retired. This is the thing he gave him when he retired. This was the old color of the room, which I still haven't taken down. Blue, cream, and brown. This Megan had made for us. And my closet. This is my grandmother's furniture. My grandmother and my grandfather's furniture. Um, Aunt Dee took it over when they passed, and then I got it when they moved. And then we have Lou and <laughs> in our other spare room, closer to the bathroom, packing to go home. <laughs> She's crying. I don't want to go. I don't. Erin loves sunflowers, Lucille Ball, and frogs. So the entire room is sunflowers, frogs, Lucille Ball and frogs. And Lucille Ball. <laughs> sunflowers, Lucille Ball, and frogs. Mm. With a couple of pictures of everybody else. And the baby sleeps here when she sleeps over. And the girls sleep in the old in bed, bed, our old bed. Yep. Say hi to Roberta and Dave. Hi, Roberta and Dave. Hi, Roberta and Dave. I'm packing a go home. <laughs> <laughs> and she liked that she had a closet to put her stuff in. Yep. Well, that's about it. Take care.